It is it's what perfect. it is. I mean, you know what I'm saying? I know I got a few seconds with you left, man. You know what I'm saying? You promised me that on um, good old 10 minutes, man. I really appreciate it. But is, you know what I'm saying? Is there anybody you like to shout out? And is there any advice that you would like to tell to anybody that, you know, following your footsteps and people that support you, man? Well, uh, I mean, the first thing first, you know, I want to tell everybody, make sure y'all follow me on Twitter. Twitter.com slash RealYellowBoy. That's R-E-A-L-Y-E-L-L-A-B-O-Y. RealYellowBoy. You know what I'm saying? I'm on Facebook. I'm on Twitter. You know, y'all can go to yellowboy.net. Hit me up. Subscribe to my Facebook. You know, I want to give a shout out to my whole BSF squad, man. You know what I'm saying? We started label BSF the game. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Everybody that hold me down, man. Just, just the whole floor, they, all my fans that support me, man. You know? And it is, hey, just, just keep it popping, man. I'm, I'm, I'm promising I'm, I'm going to keep releasing some quality music, you know, that you jam to. So be expecting real uh, music every single Monday. I release music called Meek Fake Meek Monday. And I release it on my Twitter page, you know. I just did the uh, cash, the official Cash Out remix with Bow Wow, Wale, Soldier Boy, and Cash Out. There you so, go. Yeah, I go on my Twitter page right now and get that. There you go. Yeah, man. I mean, one more thing, man. I know, I know, I, 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 you know, I don't mean to break the rules, but one, you know, what I'm saying, you don't mind giving your boy one more minute, man. You know, what I'm saying, I, I just want to know how you feel about that uh, Trayvon Martin situation, man. You know. I mean, the Trayvon situation, I think, I think it's real crazy, man. I, I, I think, I think that the, you know, government gonna do the right thing, you know, the justice system gonna, gonna handle it the way it's supposed to get handled. You know, I, I think, I think they gonna make it happen, man. So, so, you know, I, I'm team Trayvon all day, man. God bless the dead. God bless Hope the justice dead. Justice gets served. Yeah, let justice be served for real, you know. And um, you know, it, it happened in our backyard in Sanford, Florida. So it's it's a tragedy that this happens, man. And I'm pretty sure, you know, things like this, this ain't the first time it has it, it happened. So you know, and uh, it just happened to be in the light of the media right now. And hopefully that justice be served not only through this situation, through many other situations like this, and similar to come, you know. And um. I mean, what, how you feel about the election too, man? Are you voting for Barack Obama or the other guy? Tell me. Man, I'm team Barack, man. That other guy don't even know what the heck he's talking about. Every time I hear him talk, I shake my head. <laughs> I, I think Barack is a strong, strong leader, you know, and, and I'm standing by him 110%. <laughs> All right, you know what I'm saying? With great leaders, you know, we got great followers too. So, you know, and, um, you know, I just want to thank you, man, for the interview, man. Thank you. I really appreciate it. You know, ladies and gentlemen, this is spectacular. 305, one and only. You know, especially the ladies. You know, we just did an interview with Spectacular. Your one and only, truly, from Pretty Ricky. And this is King Joe the Great. Your one and only, truly, the street poet. And I'm out. And what you just heard is the interview with Spectacular, or better known as Yellow Boy now. Uh, yes, that's Spectacular from the Platinum Artist Group, Pretty Ricky. And it was exciting for me because that was my first interview. And not only that was my first interview, but that was my first interview on our 50th episode, 50th episode, excuse me. And not only it was on our 50th episode, but also it was with somebody that's from where I'm from. And it's great to see somebody that's from where I'm from to make it so far in life, you know. Um, I hope you enjoyed it because I really enjoyed it and we got more where that came from. You know, we got Eric Robeson. That's supposed to go down like a well on the boat. Um, we also got uh, Radio Inactive. Dundee PR, you know, hooked this up. So we wait for a response from Dundee PR. Because we really want to hear from Radio Active. It's a new artist. I also do not know anything about him. But, um, you know, he's, he's going to be coming in and telling the world about himself and introduce himself. Um, today, Curtis Blow Jr., to be honest with you all, Curtis Blow Jr. was supposed to be doing an a interview with us, but, you know, um, you know, due to some uh, technical difficulties um, and um, misconceptions with uh, scheduling, 
uh, it, it didn't went down. So it's all good. Uh, I'm not gonna promise you may it if it'll ever go down in the future. Uh, only God knows the future. But you know, I still wanted to show you, uh, you know, great celebrities and uh, a great interviews from us. And I hope you also enjoyed our previous shows. And uh, I promise you, you will enjoy the other shows that's ahead of you. You know, because we also gonna have the round table uh, with our homegirl Colvin. And then, you know, it's uh, two guys and a female. <laughs> that sounds like a TV episode, doesn't it? <laughs> Anyways. And uh, also, we, we're going to have R&Bs from the 90s. The best of R&Bs from the 90s coming up for you fans. That's uh, lovers from the 90s. You know, I'm a, a, a lover from the 90s. You know, I love the 90s. That's my era. You know, I feel like that's the golden era. I'm an 80s baby, I was born in the 80s, but I was raised in the 90s, and um, there's no music like the 90s, you know, um, I mean, nowadays, you know, you still got great music, but you gotta search for it, you know, but one thing that they told me that I'm gonna tell you, um, good music can never go old, you feel me, but this is King Joe the Great, the street poet, signing out, peace.